Hey guys, Request Sound is here, back in our video. So lately I've gotten a lot of requests to make a blender style drop, lead, baseline, that kind of stuff. So in this video I'm gonna show you how to make this blender style drop. It's a remake of Strack Leaving. So the final result will sound like this. <laughs> So now let's dive into the presets, sounding like this, with a lead, and a bass line. So first we're going to make the lead sound, so we're going to select in the preset, MIDI sounds like this. So we're going to use three solids, the sub oscillator, oscillator A and B, first we're going to shape the sub. We're gonna use that for a clean saw because the other two are gonna be slightly detuned. Or well quite heavily. So three lessons for us to be us to A. 16 for us to B. Just just like this, then right F01 to the fine tune of both us layers. Stack trigger and raise as fast. You can hear this will give another more detuned effect to the oscillator A and B. So that's why we have to stop oscillator to keep it kind of in the middle. Now we're gonna select the bomb pass filter. The bomb pass 24. Cut off around here. Some dry fatness. The mixer a little bit down. Some more resonance. Then we're gonna shape and flow bump, no sustain, detune, DK around 500, and some hold around 80. Then we're gonna add noise oscillator, just some simple white noise. Right and flow bump to the level. And then we're gonna shape the model legato, always for the mando, just to get a slight effect in lead. So now it's time to reopen it up with FX. First of all, there are two distortion. Drive all the way up. And mixer down to on here. Just lower the level of noise a little bit. It's too loud. Now we're gonna add some OTT. This canary that really makes a difference in the sound. We're gonna drag the lows down a little bit. Now we're gonna EQ it. With the low cut. And boost the ice a bit. Now we're gonna add a formless filter. Just to shape the sound a bit more. Cut off all the way down. The formless all the way up. Now we're gonna mix it in with the original sounds. I'm gonna hear this will get some more depth to the sound. I'm gonna finish it up. Just add some more reverb and delay. It already makes the leads a bit more wider, fuller, that kind of stuff. So now it's time to share the bass line, sounding like this. So it's like in a preset. Saw wave, two octaves down. Shape it. Something like this. We're gonna add a filter to the sound, just to cut off the highest of the sound bit. To around here. Now we're gonna add some diode 1 distortion. Quite heavily. With a post filter, just to cut off the highest. Some hyperdimension. With a little bit of hyper and some dimension. And it's time for phaser. I really use that for all my bass lines lately because it really makes it a bit more fuller. And then the last thing I'm gonna add is the OTT compression. With the highs all the way down. Sounding like this. So together, sounding like this. No track, it sounds like this. 
and that's it for brand new style leading base. So if you like the video, please leave a like. And if you see more, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next videos.